This is the 1994 Subaru Sambar Diaz Classic European Microvan. This one has a six speed manual transmission. This one has the Subaru four cylinder engine. It has 102,255 miles. It's a very, very clean van. This is the outside of it. This is the roof as well. It's in very good shape. Um, it does have a couple little flaws here and there, but for the, being a 1994, it's in very good shape. This one has the Subaru Sandbar Classic logo on the side of it, which is nice. Um, it does have the roof rack rails right here, which is also very cool. So if you wanted to put a roof rack on it, you can. Um, this van is a four x four model. Um, you pretty much click a button and it goes in the four wheel drive, but you'd ride around uh, on two wheel drive until you, if you need it, you hit the button and it goes in the four wheel drive. The outside is in good shape. Has these cool little stickers here. And got the classic sticker right there. And that's all it's stone pipe motors. Oh, let's see. This one does have the chrome, um, you know, above license plate cover, which is nice. This one has 12 inch alloys, which they got a little bit of wear on them, but they're not bad. The tires are brand new all the way around. They're Yokohamas. And they're nice. Um, this one does have a couple little spots here and there. Uh, right here, it's got a little couple little corrosion spots, but nothing big. Um, it doesn't leak or anything inside. And it's got a couple little, little spot right here. And then this guy had a little dent right here. And uh, that's when he got the dent and kind of scratched it right there. Underneath, surprisingly, it's very clean, which I'll show you that here in a second. I'm gonna show all the imperfection spots first on the outside. It does have a little bit of rubber bubble right here. It's just a rubber cover that goes over this. It does have that there. There's no leaks or anything on the inside. Um, this one has the plastic wind guards, which are nice. So when you roll your window down, the front and the rear windows do roll down. Um, this one has the chrome mirrors. And it's got all the chrome on the front, which is nice. And the front bumper is very clean. Silver. Very, very clean. As you can see, the, the paint's really nice. That's the original paint, too, by the way. It's in very good shape. See where else I can find any imperfections if I can. It's got a little couple, uh, this little, I guess, nick spots. Maybe a little where a rock or something flew off and hit it. They're really, really small. It probably can be touched up. They're not dense. It's just, I don't know, maybe it came up. Somebody was hauling a little bit of gravel and just put two little, three little spots. It's right there. It's in good shape. It's not rusty. Over here, it's got a couple little spots too as well. I guess Nick spots where somebody tried to touch it up. Right here, it's got a couple little spots too as well. Other than that, the uh, paint's in good shape. No clear coat fade. Well, a little bit right here. But for the most part, it's in good shape. Uh, just on the corners right here, it's a little bit of clear coat fade. Other than that, it's good. Yeah, just that one ding right here, or scratch, you know, really, really small, nothing big. And that's it as far as the outside body. 
which I'll show you the body on it. Body is straight, as you can see. It's got one little spot right here, also a little nick that could be touched up. It's got one little nick right here too as well, which can be touched up. Um, the glass is perfect. There's no scratches or cracks or anything in it. Yeah, all the glasses are good. All right, let me show you all the underneath. See, it's rust free. Everything's very clean. No rust. This one here. There ain't no rust or nothing. That's four wheel drive. It's very clean. There ain't no rust or nothing like that. That's the AC condenser. See, it's very clean. <clears throat> also, no rust. Let me show you all the engine. The engine's back here. The engine it's also in very good shape as far as service goes we changed the coolant on it the spark plugs and plug wires also uh, we changed the engine oil oil filter air filter um, it's got a new serpentine belt on it uh, both of them both serpentine belts are new um, the battery is brand new it's a die hard and then it's got new tires. Um, also, we serviced the AC, so it's got new Freon in it. And the timing belt was replaced at uh, 63,742 miles, which was 38,513 miles ago. Oh, As you can see, it's not rusty or anything back here. It's in good shape, no rusty. That's in good shape. That's just the engine heat shield, for not the engine, the exhaust heat shield. But as you can see, it's not rusty. It's in good shape. See, ain't no rust or nothing. The frame's solid. See, everything's solid. My face very clean. It's in good shape. clicks in and that's it <clears throat> also no rust back here or anything like that up top see it's in good shape it's very clean it's the washer fluid and that's the actual radiator cap which is crazy don't open that the reservoir is down there that's the actual radiator cap The driver door panel it's also very clean super super clean 
as you can see there ain't no rust or nothing like that it's in good shape same here that's the shock cup holder which is awesome you can put your drink on there and act as a shop absorber it's cool uh it's the driver's seat it's in good shape <clears throat> um it it has been touched up right here i guess it might have had it been had a tear but it's been repaired it's done, it's, they did an okay job they could have done a better job but it's okay it's got a rubber floor mat all season sandbar floor mat it's the clutch pedals and everything under here um there's the four-wheel drive you push that in that's four-wheel drive click it and that's normal two-wheel drive and when you put it into this this is the granny gear way way over here click it it goes into four-wheel drive automatically and then you got one through five normal and reverse it's the dash on it it's also very clean no cracks or anything like that that's the headliner it's also mint no cracks stains nothing i mean it's literally mint all the way through very good shape it's the passenger door panel it's also no tears nothing like that very clean and as you can see the door is also very clean no rust same with the door jam no rust or nothing like that very clean same here super clean that's the carpet also very clean no stains nothing like that that's the dashboard here also, it has a Bluetooth radio, which is nice. Um, it has a USB charging port, which is behind this little plastic cover. You know, you just you can put, plug your cell phone uh, cable up to it. it has auxiliary, has hands-free calling. Um, you can play your Bluetooth music through it. Um, AM, FM, it's nice. Also, it has brand new speakers in here. Both the speakers are brand new. They're nice, that's the ashtray. See, never been smoked or anything. That's your cigarette lighter plug, and that's your dashboard. You can put your wallet up here, up here, you no know, purse, wallet. And this one does have the rear heater, which you hit that button and it heats the rear, which is really cool. And yeah, the heat and the AC work really well. See, the driver uh, passenger seat looks like it's never been used. There's no tears, nothing. It's literally mint. Alright, let's get back here. This is the rear. Um, this one has the all-season floor mat, which is cool. And there's the rear heater. Um, it's pretty cool. It also has the... Let's see if I can get this open. It has the sissy bar, which is cool. Also, uh, it's like a roller coaster. You put it right here and it straps in see and it gives people something to hang on to you know you just put your arms around this and when you're climbing little hills and stuff it's pretty neat you can also strap stuff to it which is cool i call it a little roller coaster bar right there and just put that back in and it goes right down here and it's it's got a little snap on it so you snap it in and it's done it's in and that's it um you have the armrest back here which are cool and the armrest, you know, go up. Um, it also has the cup holders for your drinks, a little area to keep your cell phone, purse, wallet, whatever you need back there. Um, the seats in the back do recline. They go all the way down, just like that. See, and then button they go back up hit the button they also go back up um also the seats do fold into the floor so you hit this button here there you put, yeah, hit, it. hit the button there drops down hit the button there and drops down 
and then um, just lift this up if you have something tall to carry it's also nice because it's all open metal you could just wash it with the garden hose if you had to and this gives it like a something tall to carry see it's more room top to bottom right there see and then uh the seats also go into the floor um this seat pulls first pull this lever right here and that releases that little lock that holds that and then just drops into the floor same with this one it just drops into the floor just like that see then you close the door how it looks from the outside. It's got a lot of room back here. It's six foot five inches from here all the way to the back. It's a good room, decent carrying room. I actually moved one of these because they're narrow and you can get between spots and with it being four by four you can get anywhere pretty much with it i could actually move that on my old, old apartment with one of these it's really cool because nothing could fit between the gates that they had set up they did it on purpose but this thing it made it right through they're trying to keep vehicles out but can't keep this one out this thing just goes <laughs> the, see the back windows do roll down on both sides see just roll it down and holler at people if you're sitting in the back and you hit this that's a safety also it's child safety so you hit it and it goes all the way down that's for child safety and this is for adults it goes all the way down both windows do and the front ones do also roll down as well Yeah, everything works perfect on this vehicle. Uh, let's fire it up and we'll go take it for a ride. Make sure it's in neutral so it won't take off on me. Also, there's no smoke or nothing like that. Idle's perfectly quiet. Super, super quiet. You can hardly hear it running. That's the e-brake light and the, and the passenger seat belt light. Also, this vehicle is in kilometers. So, it is uh, 164,566 kilometers, you know, which converts to uh, it's a uh, hundred two thousand two hundred and fifty five miles which is you know this engine still has plenty of life left um they run to like two hundred fifty thousand miles and um, you can get any part for these vehicles uh, there's uh about six part suppliers that supply all the parts for this vehicle um yokohama motor is the best they're out of japan um shipping on the parts you'll usually have them within four or five days because they put them right on the airplane but all right, let's go for a ride. Yeah, the clutch is also really good. And, you know, as soon as you barely let go of it, it engages. So, you know, I personally think it's a brand new clutch, but, you know, I can't say it for sure. Because, yeah, as soon as you let go of it, it, it hooks up and goes. You know, it doesn't release at the end. It's at the beginning, which is nice. Feels like a brand new clutch, but I'm not going to say it is because, you know, I'm not 100% on that. She runs good. Um, this vehicle is uh, registered to us, Dalton Pike Motors LLC. Uh, we are a used car dealer here in Cleveland, Tennessee. Uh, this vehicle does have a clean Tennessee title. It's not just import documentation and headaches. It's actually been titled in US and it's 100% street legal. Um, 
you can register this vehicle in all 50 states um, except for uh, some counties in uh, in California and uh, some counties in Maine uh, you know if you live in Maine or California you have to ask your uh, local you know government uh, and see if uh, you can register this vehicle in your state well yeah she runs good um, that right there is that's 50 miles an hour uh, that's 50 55 uh, and she'll roll um, it, it can do 60 but realistically it was more designed for city driving but yeah she'll do 60 65 you know I wouldn't do it for a super long period of time but it can do it um, it can run 50 55 all day though so that's uh, 61 to 63 63. Yeah, she runs straight too. She's perfectly straight, doesn't pull nothing. Just a great vehicle. That's 65 right there. So I'm gonna slow down because it's uh, 55 through here. Oh, yeah, it runs good. Uh, yeah, we are a used car dealer that specializes in these kind of vehicles. Um, so uh, if you do purchase this vehicle, since we are a dealer, we can write you out a 30-day tag, and you can drive home immediately. Um, if you wanted to fly in and drive this vehicle home, we will meet you at the Chattanooga, Tennessee airport. Um, we also do deliver, so if you want this vehicle delivered to your door, uh, we can arrange that. It's no problem at all. Um, delivery costs are pretty low nowadays, so it's not too much to have it delivered to your door. Oh yeah, she runs good. Yeah, it's just a great running vehicle. Um, if uh, you have any questions, you can call or text 423-331-6050. Um, also, if you want to have a third party inspection done, uh, we welcome those. Also, uh, if you want to bring your mechanic buddy, have him check, check it out. It ain't no problem at all. Um, you know, have them come on down here. We got a lift so we can put it on a lift for you. Um, yeah, if you want to come down here, check it out. We'll put it on a lift for you as well. Well, yeah, just let me know. Uh, for payment, we accept cash, cashier check, bank wire transfer, money order, credit card. Um, we do accept personal check, but we hang on to the vehicle and the title until the check clears. Also, uh, we do accept, uh, what else? Uh, we do also accept wire, wire transfer. Um, and we do have financing options available. So if you need this vehicle financed, just let me know. It ain't no big deal. Alrighty, um, thank y'all and uh, have a blessed day. She breaks good too, see? Yep. Yeah.